Yeah, that, uh, that's received by him. So, girls, um, that's a naughty question to ask you. Yo, old Bill and all that kind of thing. You don't want to talk to the likes of me, but do you know where the killer is? He's a washing guy. Do you know where he is? No, sorry, sir. I'll pay your wages, you know that, don't you? Dirty filth. I played Tommy Tip in the East End Motley Belwitz, which is all about smashing things up. And that was just acting. Now I'm on a journey around the country to meet Will football firms who have mass offs at football matches for Will. No fake blood, no stuntmen, no makeup. This time it's just me in an editing suite in London and the country's hardest hooligans out on the streets where I'm nowhere near. I'll meet the Will top boys who tell the score. <laughs> This week we go in search of one of Russia's most feared football hooligans, the killer. With his team playing at Wembley, I went to meet Russia's top boy. Russia is a proper big country and over the last century has undergone great political and cultural changes. After the 1970 revolution started by Leon Trotsky and John Lennon, Russia went left wing and I ain't talking John Barnes, you know what I'm saying? Russia has suffered some terrible tragedies such as Tenement Square, Pompeii and of course the Great Fire of London. But it's had its triumphs too. Yuri Gargrin was the first man on the moon and they've managed to get their hands on some top bombs too, just in case it's a right proper tear up. But after the dark days of capitalism, down went Adrian's wall and the Wuskies embraced communism. Slags. Since then, the Russian hooligan culture of football has blossomed. One of the most feared firms takes their name from Russia's greatest hero, Ivan Drago, the famous boxer. They've also taken his motto, I must break you. With Russia playing England at Wembley, it gave me a chance to meet with Drago's feared top boy, the killer. Thing is, I'm a little bit lost, I can't find the Russians, do you know what I'm saying? I'm having a little bit of a trouble trying to find these naughty boys. Could be a bit of trouble here tonight, we might find them, we could kick right off and then we'll find them pretty easy, but they're around here somewhere. Where the Russians are, I ain't got a clue, you know what I'm saying? Trafalgar Square, Wed Square, who's got the best one? You can tell them now, I'm looking for their top boy, the top boy, because yep. we do a thing about football who gives them and all that so kind of thing. I'm looking for the killer. The killer, do you know the killer? Russia, what's with the Dr. Zhivago? Frankly, my dear, I don't give a damn, nor do I, and I do one. What I want to know is when he's going down with squirrels, did he come up with badges? That's what we want to know. I don't know. Does he go, when he goes down with squirrels, does he come up with badges like proper naughty, like cheese mark monkey, you understand what I'm saying? He ain't no hockey player, nothing like that. He likes proper football, you know what I'm saying? Ask him if he's a squirrel later. You can have something. You can have something. You can have something. I've heard that's what happens, proper tear up, you know, proper top boy. He's from Moscow, the geezer's from Moscow. It's nice nice to meet you all, very nice top boy. here. Proper nasty ginger geezer, you know what I'm saying? Can't trust the ginger ones. Proper nasty Ruskin. Know what I'm saying? So I said it well, you're from Russia, you ain't a spy, so how about you clean me house? <laughs> I didn't think I'd be noticed. I didn't think I'd be, think I'd be noticed. They've all seen the bell whiffs. You've all seen the bell whiffs, haven't you? The mighty bell whiffs, you've all seen them film. I didn't think anyone had seen it. I've got a cruise, you've got a stealth. Let's make a lot of money, you know what I'm saying? Finally, my search came to fruition, and I came face to face with the killer. So uh, you're, this is a killer, this is a man, it's, I've been tearing around town looking for this geezer. Turns out he's been around here the whole time. It's nice to meet your killer, they call him the killer because uh, when he goes in he don't stop until he's killed him. 
Dark box. How many years have you been you've been running with a firm? How many years you've been out there like fighting like a trooper, like a soldier with a with a top boys a washer? How long's it been kicking off? How many times have you uh, you know you've been part of the whole thing? How long's it been going on for? With him. One time. Is uh, one week. So you've been you've been you've been you've been at it one week. Your reputation, your reputation is that bad. Oi, Gorbachev, take the jam off your head and put it on some toast. You know what I mean? I hear that you've got a tattoo that says everything about the Cold oh, yeah. War, the, the whole thing about the missile, the, the nasty, the nasty, nasty side of the Cold War, the people, the peasants, the hard times of the Russian person, and it all, the war was broken down, and then it all come together, and you people were kicking off all around the place. It was proper going off, you know what I'm saying? Sparty, Moscow, and, and all those kind of people. Was this true? Proper wumbles going on? Oh, yes, that's true, yes. Were yes. you involved in those wumbles, too? Oh, yeah, the wumble. The wumble time. The wumbles, yeah. The wumble time is uh, he have tattoo and he uh, says all. You have a tattoo that, 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 that. So, so what I think the killer's trying to say he is being painted as a man to to uh, show history on his own body, which yeah. I think is I think is proper proper nice, you know what I'm saying? Tell us about the tattoo if you would killer. I have, I have a tattoo is um does it depict everything, you know? There is a say, no, I'd say is a... Was it a picture of, uh, of, of, of uh, Trotsky? Is it a picture of, uh, of Stalin? What, 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 no, what is it no, it's, it's a sickle, maybe? A no, it's a race, which is a uh, penis. 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 You like it? Come. We go to my brother's hotel. Well, you know what I mean? I don't know. I'm a sort of like off my manner here, do you know what I'm saying? Big oh, West Ham fan and all that, you know what I'm saying? Sort of off my manner, but you know what I mean? I could be persuaded maybe to have a couple of vodkas, you know what I mean? But then nothing. Nothing untoward happens, you know. I don't okay, want to get tattooed. Okay. We have with, with, tattoo with, with, you, with, but we have good time, you and me. My meeting with a killer was a most painful experience. I couldn't walk properly for days. I played Russian roulette for my life, which I survived, and regrettably, not long after this film was made, the killer was found dead in a flat. He ripped his own head off. He thought he was a Russian doll. This has been Danny Dyer, and this was the Will Football Factories. Oi, Gorbachev, leave them kids alone.